We're gonna keep that going for Ty Win, everybody. Give it up for Ty Win. Thank you, thank you very much. Good evening. Uh, my comedy style is like taking LSD. It could take up to an hour to kick in. <laughs> so some of y'all might be laughing during the restroom break, 75% into the show. So you'll be laughing when you're taking a dump. <laughs> um, so y'all can tell by the sound of my voice that I came to America through very Negro means. <laughs> and when I first came to America, I was poor, right? So forgive me, but I was buying really cheap food. But, but I didn't know that cheap food was bad for you because I was under the impression that, hey, America is the number one country in the whole wide world. So why would they feed their people garbage? <laughs> and it turned out I was dead wrong. <laughs> because every year, Taco Bell just come out with something new to murder your intestine <laughs> and Agent Orange your butthole. <laughs> Trust me on this. Taco Bell gave me PTSD. Post-traumatic spicy diarrhea. <laughs> it went on for days. Taco Bell knew his diabolical invention to destroy American gastrointestinal system. It's the nacho fries. I taste it, it's fine. But how come nobody called them out on that? Like, hey, you're supposed to be a fake Mexican fast food joint. Stick to the script, buddy. What's next? I'm gonna walk inside Panda Express and see teriyaki tater tots? If I ever have white kids, that's what I'll call them. Teriyaki tater tots. Hey, kids, wanna know your origin story? Daddy spreads teriyaki all over your mom tater. And that's how you ended up extremely hard working, but somehow still complain about your new job because they wouldn't let you vape. You work in a hospital, son. Um, <laughs> speaking of kids, who in here have parents? <laughs> I'm 31, right? And my parents, I guess time is running out for them. So they're pressuring me to have a kid. They got so desperate to the point where they're trying to hook me up with their friend daughter back in Vietnam. And they say that they put in a good word for me. <laughs> they told her, Ty's a very respectable man. He does free public speaking for poor Americans <laughs> that couldn't afford a Netflix subscription. <laughs> <laughs> Who in here have kids? Show your hand. Well, I can't see them anyways. <laughs> but, do you know the average cost of raising a kid in America to the age of 17 is $233,000? And do you also know for $233,000, I'm willing to never have sex again? <laughs> Yeah, for that amount of money, I wouldn't even touch myself. <laughs> so who in here is willing to put the money up? Who in here don't want to see any teriyaki tater tots being made? <laughs> uh, 
Um, I've been doing stand-up comedy for about three years now. So that means for about three years, I've been drinking nothing but PBR. <laughs> Anybody that drink PBR, we know we drink it because we have one thing in common, right? We drink it because we don't drink it for the taste. Same way we don't eat booty for the taste. <laughs> We eat it due to insufficient funds. Um, here's another thing about me. Do y'all know that I have a famous coach? Yeah. They exist. Like, coach that kind of like coach celebrity to become famous and um, I know her watch my stand-up video which was a very bad idea she watched it and then oh man the night is blinking I don't want to go over time so uh, oh yeah I want to give a shout out to my cousin Tan Tran and the movie uh, Pia Fargo North Dakota 